Okay, we have not one, but two traffic trouble spots today. And here to tell us about it is the man that works at two stations and two day parts, <laughs> Sean Murphy. Sean. And he's got two eyes with big bags under them to prove it. <laughs> Northeast extension of the Pennsylvania Turnpike. Well, good news, bad news. We had an accident. That's the bad. The good news is it's cleared southbound, but we still see yellow flow. That means traffic is slow moving down towards that Lansdale exit as things loosen up and get back to normal. Now, traffic light troubles in two separate places. In Chester County is number one, Phoenixville. The traffic lights are out. Pretty big intersection here at Bridge Street and Route 23. You can see some jam traffic 76 West uh, heading out towards 202 right there near the Mall Boulevard exit. Eastbound coming off the tolls and away from 202. Inbound traffic slows down as well. The second traffic light uh, malfunction is over there in Camden County, Runnymede, New Jersey at Black Horse Pike and 9th Avenue. And you can see the jam traffic uh, coming in towards the 42 freeway. This is backed up to Route 70. No delays reported on mass transit. Larry Alicia, back to you. Yes, indeed I am. And we started off in Jersey again. Traffic light malfunction still uh, causing troubles in Camden County. It's in Runnymede at 9th Avenue in the Black Horse Pike. 295 South is really jammed up. Might be some Jersey Devil fans coming down to check the flyers out tonight uh, from Route 70 straight down to the 42 Freeway. 42 South is also slow coming off the Walt Whitman Bridge down through 295. That accident uh, brand new in Montgomery County is in Abington, Huntington Pike and Berkeley Avenue. Mention the flyers. You can see delays down here in South Philadelphia. Things are looking good at the stadium area, but that will change in the Gerard Point Bridge northbound coming out of Delaware County should get backed up so you could take the Platt Bridge instead and come in the back door. We got a live shot of 76 out near the Blue Route and this is what it looks like. Lots of heavy flow inbound here. Looks good heading westbound out towards the Gulf Mills exit and the second camera shot takes us to 202. Southbound of your taillights at Route 29. This is a typical backup and look for 401 construction 202 overnight. Larry back over to you.